this magnet literally makes it like disappear. I don't know why it did that, but we went away. Yeah, it's a bit. I'm telling you, we're just gonna have to like bump up our stream to a different time slot so that I'm just having fun with stripes over here. Well, they look awesome. And so, this one like got rid of the whole color. Look, it just went to black. Somehow. Strange. You have white coasters? I do, I do, I do. I'm trying, Emma. I get in the zone. I like have to make everything work somehow. White I like the stripes. Because I like you could see the two different ships. Same. So we're going to keep one out, maybe two out, just as a comparison. This is the only magnet I like, and this one. I wonder if you could just mix like a magnetic powder into any powder and make it a magnet powder. If you purchased, yes. Well, mm -hmm. would it bond though it would like to the pigment enough to make it move? I don't know, too. All right, let's see what these bad boys look like on white. Well, now I'm confused. I don't know what... Oh. Any problems? Yeah, there's not enough in here for the whole coaster. Mm. I mean, I'm up in there getting that out. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I see. <laughs> so, as you can see, it just looks super diluted when you don't have it on black background. This is the same mixture that we did the first round of tests on. And maybe that's what it is. The particles are such yeah, that... Yeah, because this looks like... They look like poopy. No, I mean, it's not bad. I mean, you can see a shift, for sure. But also, you can see the inconsistencies in how the pigments are laying. Agreed, Clara. It would be an interesting test. Bow show. Let's see if it works. And so it still moves the particles. That's just not enough for us to read. Sure, it does. So it still does stuff, but it just looks better. It doesn't even look like the same colors as what we did the first round. No, this round. looks like... Mm. Oh, nice, nice. Purple and gray. I'm doing a job. Customer wants black, red, orange, green, no shimmer, no sparkle. I'm terrified to start such a non-color job. I'm not good enough actually to do a project like this. I might be able to. No, ma'am. You got this. What up, Shane? Hi, Shane. Um, Hello, RC dude. What is up? Um, There's nothing. No, I can't. I'm gonna have to mix them. Yeah, just like mix them. It doesn't look the same at all, for sure. Black, red, orange, and green. <laughs> maybe do a sample job, like a sample palette for them, and show them that Wait, maybe just a peak those like aren't the best colors to put together. And 
like an art piece or like uh, a chair? So do a sample board, and on one hand, if they love it, then the burden's off of you. And if they hate it, then you can talk them into colors that probably would work better together. Sample boards are always the way to go. So grab a tile. I did some Sugiban shelves today. I was thinking of doing the backboard and epoxy. What do you think? I think it would look awesome. Also, I don't know what a shoe Sugiban shelf is. And I'm 100% sure I said every bit of that wrong. <laughs> like, not one syllable was accurate, I'm pretty sure. I mean, this is just... Oh, this is turkey. This looked so good on the black. Do you know another color? Even, like, what is, like, what is that? Here, have some of this. Oh, this will be a great mix. <laughs> so it looks awesome right here. Look at that cherry. That is not what aqua. it looks like. In oh, that one does. But it's in a pile, so it's a, yeah, it's, you can't see the white through it. But when we like manipulate it out, it's not going to be as awesome. But we gonna show you guys because what we do her. Blomp, blomp. Yeah, chameleon on white is. I mean, for the amount of money that any chameleon from any company anywhere that you're going to pay to get it, it's. I mean, you still get an effect, but I just think it's kind of kind of a waste, a waste to put it yeah. on. I'll say it. It's a waste to put it on a white background. It's a waste because it, it doesn't yes. show. You can't I, put it on other colors though. You could put it on like, like well, you can't see my nails, so I was just gonna say, look at my nails. Uh, on a like a dark purple or a dark navy to get more of a blue out of it. You could do that, but just on the white, like this, just look, you can't. I don't even want to say what this is reminding me of. Not think. Dog agrees. But we definitely does agree. So, as you can see, it except for the striations that we put in from the magnet, you can't even really see the shift much on this one. And it was just so gorgeous. <laughs> is what it is. What? Oh no! Yeah. Mm. Womp. Like to put it on the white just makes it. <gasps> Laura Taylor, what's up? How are you doing? Oh, I haven't seen Laura forever. I know, she's been super busy, like, being a you know, frontline COVID lady. Saving the world, basically. Okay, where's my magnets that I like? Say, oh, I have a torch. There's one right there. What, you don't know how to use a torch? Yeah, I don't use it. Why? Well, you've had a bad experience with knives and scissors lately, but you haven't given those up. <laughs> that's, a, that's a fact. That looks so pretty right there. It's a lie. Oh. Lie. Look how pretty this is. So Super pretty. awesome. This it's is really pretty. Gorgeous. But wait. Mm. Nope. You could use it as a base coat for sure. This one stayed a little bit, but you can still see the particle layout. It's not the most beautiful. Oh no, Claire, I also uh, cut myself the other day with just normal scissors. <laughs> She's so traumatized, not she couldn't <laughs> even really just say scissors just then. She said scissors. <laughs> I can't. So bad. I'm here. Granted. Here. I've never cut myself with scissors in my entire life. Twice okay. in a week. That's kind of fun, though. Okay. Are you doing the strike? Oh, see? That's cool. But not on the white. I'm just not digging that backgroundy color. <gasps> Valerie, you're right. It would look great. Evelyn, this one is... Mm -hmm. We have no idea at this point. Just admit it. I want paste. To, yeah, it is one of the gels. I'm uh, not Hawaii. No, I think it's um, Bali. No, verb. 
Maybe Grand Canyon? I don't know. No, not the... No, no you're no right. The first one you're thinking of. Um... Spray paint underneath something close. Okay, so I'm gonna spray paint this one and not Chanda Nepal. Possibly. Let's do where am I? What are what are we doing? What are you trying to You're do? You're gonna spray paint the face of it because that's the color. Well that's what I did with my nails. So my nails normally would be I did it on like a purple. And they turn more of a lavender instead of like a crazy rainbow hollow. It'll work really well. Well, you know where it will. Hi, Holly. I'll be here for a while, so get used to this. Have you seen Lauren Taylor's new like RV trailer slash? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to go around like the U.S. in a big giant house that. on wheels. Same. With amazing puppies. Same. So much same. You know it, Beansy Butt. I know it. Oh, yes, I know. We're going to go. We're going to go. Okay, so I spray painted this one a deep blue color. Exhibit A, B, and C. No one is dizzy or vertigo triggered. No. My theory is that as long as it's not on a light background, it should look pretty cool. Look red. Red. No, they don't. My shirt's red. That's like a pinky color. Fine, you're right on reds and I'm right on powder. We don't know that yet. We need the final I mean, result. Looks great so far. You'll get the more blue Definitely looks better than on the white. One hondo person. Whoops. I got a drippy drip. I need twitches so I didn't do a design yet. Oh yeah. Oh well those go on. Well there's still bubbles. So we're gonna let these set up for a few hours and then we're gonna come back in and hit them with heat again just a little bit to pop any bubbles that may have floated up and then okay miss relax then we're going to magnetize them again so it definitely even looks better on a blue background the darker the better for sure of any hollow chameleon I 100% agree. The only time with nails that I ever did that would be, like I said, like a French manicure, you know? I tell you what, I pink bet I could... And, pink and whites, depending on what year you are. I bet I could do, like, you know how people are getting holographic hair? I bet I could do holographic this. That's almost what you got going. I know, that's what I'm saying. I bet I could... Tossing some glitter. Go see that? Good to go. That's right here. Oh, and they got it. Holly, what would I love? Um, hey, Megan. Um, is it okay if y'all share links to me? Looking for new artists to follow along with friends here on Artist of Death. Sure. Could you layer two colors and use a magnet? Um, it would probably convolute the shift because it's a chameleon. 
But yeah. I have two colors on this one, so. Oh, I should blend them together. I blend this one with two different ones. And at the moment, it looks like I blend. It's not attractive. Yeah, it's not doing and much. And it's not, it's like, it's, I'm calling that zombie color. It's like flesh and green. Look at it. What are those brush things called? These are nail art magnets. Yes. Are you going to do some thing things? Um, yeah, none of them are. Would it maybe separate the top color and then show the other? Mm, confused. Hi, Donna Parker. It does look Labrador ID. The beach house I'm staying at in Florida called Mermaid Hideaway. Oh, this is that fun leaf. <laughs> Jealous. Anytime, Rumpel. I know, it's super leafy. Like, oh, really? This is turning into northern lights over here. I don't know what's going on. That's a powder one. Or a... That thing over there. Gel? Yeah. Oh, you touched it. Stop it. Well, stop it. So I definitely think that this is worth investigating further and getting a larger magnet to do so. Yeah, but I don't have any really strong ones. Like on this one, you can all but only see blue now because it just doesn't stand out on really anything but black, except for some angles. Like that though. I, think I used a this. You would think I'd have three lines since it's three mega nits together. But uh, that's not the case. Black or dark base is what they do to my nails. Yeah, I think that's just a necessity for these kind of pigments. Because this is just not cute. This is not. This is one of the pretty ones that we right, like. Right, because you can see. I don't think you could see it on the camera, but you can see the little particles that I'm trying to come up with. Probably. The pigment grain. The grains. Microns. Uh. Maybe. I need tweezers. There's, um, stuff. Stuff. Hair or something. Tweezers. There's the tweezers, everyone. Where are they? I see scissors. I need tweezers. There's a hair return. Just hit it with the magnet again. Stop growling. I wasn't growling those mm -hmm. guys. As purring. Lies and fairy tales. Chameleon pigments are so expensive, I would be scraping those white coasters and putting it on some black ones. That's very fair. Hey, little boy dogs. Yeah. Hi, Gianna. Hey, Jude. <laughs> and some designs still there but that crisp line is not which is why using with UV resins or a fast setting resin is more uh, profitable in terms of payoff from magnet no, particles I, 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 I. no boy cat So, um, I mean, this one's not the zombie one. If there wasn't the magnet leaves in it, I don't really mind that color, but I'm weird in, like, the zombie look. It looks like a zombie. Like, it's sort of fleshy, but, like, zombie. 
You don't think that looks... Zo- it's very zombie-esque color. It is. <laughs> sure. Dead flesh. Got I, it. Check. Like That's it. what they should call this. Dead flesh. I like it, though. Without the weird leaf things. Can I do the, like, cool magnet thing in it? You can do whatever Stripes. you want to do. Like, it's not showing the uh, little, what, grain particle things. Is- oh, yeah, it is. Oh, I changed. Man. I did like it. But now it's showing a more. Cause, mm-hmm. I'm going to take this pretty one. Okay. See how awesome it looks on a black background? And you can't see the little particles like you can with this. Is it sh- I mean, yeah. Y'all know what we're saying. Y'all know. I really don't mind this uh, zombie flesh one. It's what I'm naming it. Zombie flesh. Zombie flesh. It's what it looks like. And it's cool looking. Yes, Walking Dead. One of my favorite shows. That's why I like that color. Never fails as soon as it's like almost time. The boys are warning up, like, what's up? They know it's time. Thank you, Laura. Oh, I hit the wrong one, but I like that button too. all of this. Laura Taylor! Was that the buzzer from a second ago? Yeah. Oh. Double buzz. Double buzz. So, what we have learned is we need to use quicker setting resin. Yeah. Powders, you use less, a lot less powder. Pigment. Oh, that's fun. There we go. Appreciate that so much, Laura. You're amazing. Can't get it. Okay. Oh, that was so difficult. Hold on, Beansy Boo. Where's my... Did. You see that? Hmm? Bowie and the cats. Laura, thank you! <laughs> She's gonna cover my power bill for that's the my, studio. That's my that's favorite not. sound. Mm-hmm. Me too. Hi, baby. So excited. Them are so excited. Yes, Emma, she did give us another 99 because she is amazingly supportive. I just got a knee check. Precious little moo kisses. We love you, Laura Taylor. Thank you so much for your support. Every dollar that comes through the channel, we put right back into it. Okay, I'm just put you right there then. What, 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 what? Um, if you guys don't know Laura Taylor, she hasn't been around for a little bit because she has been tirelessly working in the hospitals making sure people are safe and fixing COVID patients and doing everything she can to combat this uh, pandemic. They love you guys too. Oh, my big boys. Oh, my big boys. Okay. One second. Oh, oh. 
we'll do another uh, video on doing these um, probably earlier in the day because it seems that since everyone's at home, boy, since everyone's at home, internet service in the evening is not as reliable, so we may just make sense. push it up in the day a little bit. And the fire sale on Saturday is also going to be early. He did, Laura Taylor. John, we just just finished, but we will be doing another review on these because I want to do it with Quick Coat, a fast setting resin. I think it'll look better. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, if you missed it, this video will be public <laughs> to rewatch. Okay, okay, okay. So, um, thank you guys for watching. Read all these things. Follow us on all other social media stuffs. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have anything uh, that you wish for us to test or check out, let us know. Uh, let whatever company know to send some stuff to us. Um, to check out and um, we're here to review it we're demo on demand you know uh, be kind to one another you never know what someone's going through such a true statement and um, we'll see you guys tomorrow Clara's coming to town pretty sure tomorrow and uh, we're gonna do some art stuff so we'll see you guys manana love you guys so so much bye bye I said bye Say bye. Oh, oh look how exciting. Yeah. Yeah. He's the hypothetical one. So exciting.